In this video, I'm going to show you how you can use Warrior Plus to earn money as an affiliate marketer. I'll show you how you can sign up to the platform, how you can choose good offers to promote as an affiliate, how you can get approved for those offers, and I'll also show you at the end of the video how you can withdraw money, and I'll withdraw money live on video. So getting straight into the video, I'm on Warrior Plus, and I've got here by going to warriorplus.com. So go ahead and type that in and it will take you here. Once you're here, you want to go to free sign up in the top right hand corner. And that will redirect you to this page here. Now, if you don't already have an account, you can go ahead and create one. So I'm just going to enter a new username here. I'll then enter in a password and I'll also enter in an email. After I've done that, I can agree to the terms and conditions and go ahead and click on create account. Now I've done that, it's going to ask me to verify my account. So they would have sent an email over, which I'm just going to go to now. So here is that email. You just want to go ahead and click on complete the registration and that will take you to a new window. And now we can simply log into our account. You can see it's now activated. So here we are in our dashboard. It's going to say welcome to Warrior Plus. And then it's going to ask you what is the number one reason you created an account today? Now for most of you, we're trying to make money with affiliate marketing. So you want to click here. I want to earn money as an affiliate for other people's products. So go ahead and click on that and then it will open up a new article. Now we just want to click and go to Warrior Plus here and I'll show you the rest and I'll show you what you need to do now. Now I've made around $2,000 with Warrior Plus so I'm going to show you how you can find a good offer that converts, how you can get approved for that offer and then I'll withdraw some money live on camera for you guys to see how that works. So now I'm going to go to dashboard in the top right hand corner. So now we're on the main dashboard for Warrior Plus. Here you can see we've got the top products for today, yesterday, the last seven days, and also the last 30 days. Now you can go ahead and click on these products and it will open up the sales page and you can decide if you want to promote them or not. But this isn't a great way to go ahead and find products. Of course, you might want to promote the number one top product today. In that case, you would just copy it and make a note of the name. And But to really find products, you want to go to affiliate, then go to offers, and here it will give you a list of all of the offers which are currently available to you. So we can go ahead and search for an offer title slash keyword. So if we found an offer on that first page, we could copy it and then just simply paste it. And we could simply search for the offer. So here it is. And if we wish to promote the offer, we could promote it here. You can also filter by vendor name and you can sort by pool score, launch date, sales, visitor value, average sale, conversion rate and vendor. And then you've got more pre-launches here which you can also filter through. Now you can see here there are 9,000 products on Warrior Plus currently that we can promote. So you've got some promoted offers here and then you've got the offers which are just going to be listed. So each one of these lines here is a different offer created by a different vendor. So here we've got a profitable done for you job search site. This offer was released on the 9th of January. It sold 1,000 plus copies. It's got a conversion rate of 14%. The visitor value is $3.64. The average sale is $26. And it's got a really low refund rate at 1%. So when you're looking for offers to promote here, the first thing I would look for is some of these awards here. So you can see that this vendor is a top 1% vendor and they've had 17 featured offers. If they're a top one or even a top 5% vendor, it means that they've had consistent products over and over again, which convert and make money. The next thing I would look at is how many sales they've had. If they've had more than 1000 sales, you know that a load of affiliates have promoted this and gotten sales with it. So it works in all different types of traffic sources. Then I would check the conversion rate. You can see this one converts at a 31% conversion rate which is honestly insane. So you know that the landing page for this is optimized really well and the traffic that gets sent to that landing page often converts really high. And that shows by the visitor value. So each visitor on average is worth $10, whereas this product here, each visitor is only worth $2. Also an important metric to pay attention to is the refund rate. So the refund rate here is 1.1%, which is really low and really good. Uh, but you get some which are 6% and if we scroll down we can probably find one higher. So yeah, you've got 12% and 11% refund rate. I wouldn't go ahead and promote anything with a 12% refund rate because you'll find you'll get a lot of sales 
but a lot of people will, will refund because the product just doesn't do what it's supposed to. So when you've looked at the stats and you've found a good one, we'll say this one here, you can go ahead and click on it and it will take you into kind of like the back end of that offer. If you then scroll down, you can see the person who's made the product, you can see the price range, and you can see the commission range that you'll get for promoting this offer. You can see how many sales it's had, the conversion rate, the visitor value, and the refund rate. And then if we scroll down again, you can see more affiliate information about this product. Now, if you scroll back up to the top and you go to products, you can see here what products and upsells are in the main product. So on Warrior Plus, they have a lot of products which have upsells and downsells. So this right here will be the main product and you'll pay $20 for that main product and you'll get a $9 or $10 commission. And then once somebody's bought this product, it's gonna try and upsell them different products for different prices. And if you get someone to buy the main product, the chances are they're going to buy some of these upsells and you're gonna earn additional commissions just from them being upsold different products. If you go to the funnel map, you can see that in action. So you can see here is the main product and it's going to upsell them different products. If they buy that, it will upsell them that. If they don't buy it, it will downsell them that. And there's just a different sequence depending on what people buy and what people are interested in. You can see here it says upsell and downsell. So let's say you found the product that you want to promote. You can't actually promote this right away because you need to go ahead and request approval. To do that, you will click on request approval here and it will load up this page where we can then request approval to promote this offer. Now, if you're a beginner and if you've got no sales on your account, you might have to put something in the notes to get approved quicker. So you need to explain to the vendor why they should trust you and why and how you're going to promote that product. So if it's through YouTube, if you've got a YouTube channel, an Instagram channel or any social media, or if you have an email list, you want to write this here in a couple of lines so they can see it and approve you. Then once you've got approved for one offer and you've got some sales, all of the vendors in future will be able to see that and they will just approve you straight away. So just getting your first approval is the hardest part. After that, it's much easier. I'll show you what it's like once you've been approved on my normal account. So here I am logged into my normal account, which I usually use. I'm, I'm in the dashboard and once you get approved for an offer, you can find it in affiliate and then offers. And then if you go to all offers, you can go to approved only and that will show you what offers you're approved for. And then it will be green and it will say get link. So you can click on that and then you can find your link. And this will be your unique link, which will take people to the product. Now, once you're sending traffic to an offer, you might want to check on your stats. To do that, you will go to affiliate and then you will go to stats. And that will show you all of the stats for today, yesterday, this week, or you can filter by all time or any parameters really. And that will show you here your stats. So you can see in total, I've had 3,777 hops, which means clicks. I've had 148 sales, a conversion rate of 4%, and that's earned me $1,927. And you can see the breakdown here for different products, and you can see individual stats per product. So now let's withdraw some of this money once we've seen it in our stats. So to withdraw it, you will go to your account up here in the top right, then go to Warrior Plus Wallet, and then you can see I've currently got $14 in my account, which I'll withdraw for you. So we're going to go to withdraw on the left here. And then it's going to ask me to add a PayPal account or a bank account, which I've already done. Then I can choose how much I want to withdraw. So we'll withdraw £14 at $14.24. You can see here the minimum is $10. I'm then going to click on withdraw funds. Confirm that. And $14 will then be transferred in up to 48 hours. So that's how you can use Warrior Plus. That's been the basics. Please do leave a like and comment down below and make sure you subscribe for more Make Money Online videos and I'll see you in the next one.